Is everyone ready to blow up this barricade and move into the morgue? Because I'm not. <laughs> it says evacuate this area immediately. And I want to evacuate this immediately, immediately because I'm ready to prove myself when I blow this up. I'm wondering if there's a whole bunch of necromorphs going to come out of here. I mean, we don't know what's going to happen. Planting the hydrogen bomb. Okay, here we go. Is that like the uh, defibrillator pads or something? Okay, plant the explosive charge. Check. Take cover. Check. All right, let's do this. Do 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 do. Lucy, I'm home. Okay. Destroy the barricade. Check. We're gonna find the captain's body. Yes, captain. We find the captain's body. Oh my god, oh my god. Whoa. Get out of here. You know, I only just noticed this, but on my back, there's like a pentagon on the back there. I think that's new, right? That wasn't there before. It's like another thing added. So whenever you... Oh, okay. So when it lights up, yeah, see how it goes dark there? If it lights up, that's something I can use my um, telekinesis powers on. Okay, cool. Right, nothing. Yep, see, there you go. That's cool, man. That's a nice little... I just noticed that. Cool. All right, going into the morgue. Let's. Uh... Remember, when you reach the morgue, find Captain Matthias's body. Get his rig codes, and the computer's all ours. Right. Okay. Plasma cutter upgrade. Sick. What is this saying? Give them hope. Give them strength. Why is my light flashing like this? It's time. Yeah, it is time to kick some ass. All right. Save me, save us. I will save you. Because Doom is here. Can you imagine if Doom... Level 1 required... See, that's new. That never used to be here. Security clearance level 1 required. Needed. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Imagine if the um, Doom guy was here. He would totally fuck this ship. <laughs> He'd fuck this ship up. All right, let's go. Okay. Hearing noises. That's freaky. More bodies. What does it say? Harris is asleep. After another dose of sedative, he seems literally unable to sleep without chemical aid. Most people succumb to exhaustion after more than 50 hours of waking regardless of circumstances. Not Harris though. His bizarre explanation of the events on the colony points to the same paranoia we've seen elsewhere planetside. His guilt is not in doubt. Two security officers were present when he took Dr. Schiario hostage and murdered Nurse Evans. I don't know if I'm saying these words right. And Harris doesn't deny his actions, but he knows no remorse. In fact, he insists there was no crime, specifically that Evans wasn't a nurse when he killed her. This is classic sociopathic behavior, but Harris exhibits no other symptoms. He is a, a fable and friendly, able to empathize uh, over uh, and offer original opinions when are questions about Evans' murder. However, he becomes withdrawn and uncommunicative. He claims the explanation is stuck in his mind and that talking about it mixes up his messages. He also undergoes intermittent hallucinatory uh, periods, again similar to those experienced by other con colonists. During his long waking periods, Harris exhibits writing behavior on any available surface, claiming the dreams need to speak and that he's attempting to make it whole again. What that means, I haven't determined yet. Given the complexities of his case, I plan to reach out to my colleagues because I have no effing idea what's going on. Okay, sounds good to me. All right, let's keep going. Medical 
Officer Nicole Brennan. Medical is overwhelmed. We need help. Oh, Nicole Brennan. Look at his wounds. Pretty sure that's my girlfriend. Can't handle so many trauma cases, and the command crew won't tell us what's happening. She's looking fine as hell. All right. Oh, and Nicole's hologram. It went over here, right? Nothing there. All right, let's see what we got here. Remove the battery. How do I remove the battery? Is this showers? Is that noise? Okay. Medical log, Dr. Nicole Brennan. So much for being paranoid. I repurposed this room to run counseling sessions without unitologists interfering. Now it's the only place I feel safe. I recovered a limb after yesterday's attack. Genetically, it's human tissue with bizarre mutations, but it's just a sample. It's not enough to figure out a cure. I need... Wait, where's that report from engineering? Oh, here. The engineers pulled something out of machinery. Limbs missing, torso intact. Okay. Time for a real autopsy. <laughs> All right, so we have to go find the autopsy report in engineering. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, okay, here's some x-rays of the infected. Yeah, that that's creepy. This is weird, man. Why is it like this? Is that the arm that she was working on? Oh, it is. It's the arm she was working on. Okay, it looks. it's not really an arm. It's like a blade. Almost like a sword. Oh, there's pictures here. Look, she's got a full picture of them. Okay, so she actually sort of knew what was going on with these things. She had some idea. Right, lights. Alright, let's do it. This isn't scary at all. Okay, alright, let's grab this thing. What was that? What was that? Oh, jeez! Oh my gosh! Oh! Oh my god, it's still alive! Whoa, 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 whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh my gosh. Oh, oh my gosh, run, 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 run! run. Oh! Oh my gosh! Run, 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 run! What is that? Oh my, get away, get away! Oh my- Oh! Jeez! Scared the crap out of me. Die, baby! I kind of feel bad stomping on him. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. Give me that. Put it in this thing. That scared the crap out of me. Okay, what's this here? Alright, Isaac, we got this, man. It's okay. Okay. 
plasma energy. Take that. Okay. Right, what is this? Yeah, this looks like where they were like... There's a bit of a party in here, by the looks of it. And I wasn't invited. What is that? Give me that. Okay, let's go. Anything else? Is that a log? Nope. Just dead bodies. Just bodies. Get out of here. Get... Get out of here. Oh my god, big one. Baby, get out of here. Oh, these babies freak me out, man. Get out of here. Oh. Better not come back alive, man. Okay, dead guy. Oh my gosh. What is this? Oh my god! They like it's like a meat grinder in there. The tree just a skull. That's disgusting. All right, let's keep going. We got this, guys. Oof! And they've really done well with the sound in this. All right, where do we go? Okay, that way. Oh, gosh, you know. I have to admit, the dismember system in this is completely overhauled. Like, the damage is just completely unique, you know? Depending on where you shoot the, uh... The necromorphs, it, like... Totally strips them away. If you keep shooting, like, the leg or something... The layers, like, take away each part of the body and peel it off. So the tool is just bones. It's freaking awesome, man. Alright, let's go. Let's keep moving. Oh! Oh my gosh! Oh, jeez! Oh. Reload, reload, reload. Mercer, get it tight. You were in surgery, so I left this with Warwick. He'll be discreet. I just got the latest report from Agent 7. The situation's worse than Captain Matthias will admit. 40% of the colony's population is now showing symptoms. Depression, hallucinations, more violence. People are dying down there. I know it's linked to the marker somehow, but I just don't have enough data. Or sir, maybe I was wrong. We need answers by any means possible. That patient, Brent Harris, might be our last hope. Node. Sick. Oxygen? I don't need oxygen yet. <coughs> well, that was scary, man. That's... that... Oh, okay. That, that one... The ones behind me scared me. They legit scared me, that one. Okay. Gosh, the lighting in this is so cool. Security 
scratching my brats. And you will love me with them. Fuck it. I'll cut them out. I'll cut them out. I'll cut them out. What? Is there like a rat problem here or something? That's weird. Intensive care unit? Oh my god. That is disgusting. She really dirtied that blade, man. I'm guessing that girl was the one on the audio just now. Okay, so, um... So another thing I just noticed, like, from the previous episode, the heart and breathing rate will be um, based on, like, the study of a four-year-old man. So the game uses a complex system to dynamically change these depending on what state of the player is in. So running, walking, you know, you're injured or distressed, or he sees something that's, like, traumatizing, his breathing will change uh, based on the situation you're in, which is pretty cool, man. Like, that's now his heartbeat. I could hear his heartbeat on my headphones. Just He was just slowly his heart racing. You know, his breathing increased. And depending on what happens, Isaac will say something. That's so cool. That's really... Oh my gosh, I think I thought I saw someone over there for a second. That scared me. Alright. Oh, thank God. Save. Save, save. Save. Save to be safe. Safe to be saved. Okay, what is this? It's locked. I can't get in there. All right. Find the captain's body. Yeah. Holy shit, man! Oh. Oh, baby. Out of here, baby. I'm guessing I want to need. Wait, not that. No, I don't. I don't want a tentacle. I want this thing. going down that was a pretty cool explosion man all right it's full I don't I don't need oxygen a morgue okay what is that is that just a head that's a head all right. That's so cool. I'm just listening to Isaac's breathing. All right. Holy shit, that scared me. <laughs> My reflex was so slow, man. I was like, oh crap, what is that? All right. So it lights up when that pen the pentagon on my back there lights up whenever there's something I can grab. It's cool. What's this? Are 
these are pretty interesting to read. Okay, this was, um, it is my unfortunate duty to officially pronounce Captain Benjamin Matthias dead. Reports of the exact circumstances surrounding his death are conflicted and will be left for the investigators to determine once we return to port. I will constrain my comments to the condition of the body. Subject was in generally good health for his age, although cursory blood test indicates his um, was very low with eosophilus in particular almost non-existent. His pre-flight physical exam showed no such problems, indicating rapid onset but it does not appear to have had any effect on his death. Multiple contusions on the arms and hands to get a brief struggle pre-mortem. Cause of death was a single prolonged trauma to the ocular body which continued on through the cavity wall and into the frontal lobe, causing rapid neurotrauma, seizure and death. Damn, is this the captain? It's like a hole in that guy. That's, that's nothing. All right. It's just like bodies everywhere. Okay, what's in here? Holy shit. Oh crap. More of them are coming. Hey. Oh shit, I'm out of ammo. Whoa, whoa, what the? Get away, get away, get away, get away, get away! Get away, get away, get away! Damn, man. Okay, what's this? What's this? Isaac, what's your status? Do you have the captain's rig? Fuck me! Ugh. Transmitting codes now. I saw it, Hammond. A flying one turned the captain's body into a, another one of those things. The same must have happened to Chen. God, maybe the command computer has something. Uh, where's Daniels when you need her? Head back to the security checkpoint. It's safer there. At least I can upgrade your clearance. Okay, so we got to go go to the security uh, station. All right. Clearance confirmed. All right, sick. Level one clearance. You may now call me Captain. <coughs> Captain Isaac Clark. Whoa. Isaac. I'm here. What the hell's happening? The computer says the Ishimura's engines are offline. We're on a decaying orbit toward Aegis 7. Oh, God. I have to get to engineering. There's no time. That tram station's offline. Unless... Here. Head back to the flight deck. I'll guide you from there. If this damage report's right, there's a shortcut to engineering. Oh, it's in here. 
Does that mean I can open these? Level two, security clearance required. Oh. What the? How do I... I got full inventory ready? Oh, I need to drop some of this stuff. What are these things? Stasis pack schematics. Oh, okay. I need to go to... Uh... How do I get out of here? I need to get to a shop and um, drop off these schematics. What's this? Nice. What the? Drop more. Can I? Okay, what? Yeah, I saw that message before. Did I pick that up or not? I did. Oh, good. Alright, let's go. Let's go, Isaac. I need to get to a shop. Ah, there's a store here. Cool. Drop these schematics off. Okay, what's this? Schematic submitted. Items now available for purchase. Pulse rounds. Sick, sick. Okay, schematic submitted. It's now available for purchase. Stasis pack. Uh, what's this? I can buy... Okay, I can buy that stuff. Can I sell stuff as well? What's this? That's my cutter upgrade. Okay, sell that. Don't need that. Can sell some of this rounds maybe. Yeah, sell some of that. Alright, anything else? Definitely need some of those. Heaps of ammo for that. I think I'll use this gun for a bit. But I definitely need to upgrade a... Um, my cutter. I wonder if I can go into my map actually. I need to find... where is it? Sh bench. Just that symbol. Okay. Bench, bench, bench. Where is the bench? Bench. Oh, there's a bench there. I'm sure I'll come across the bench eventually. Alright, let's go. These bodies moving. Please tell me the bodies aren't moving. Cargo. Is there a bench down here? My heart's still beating. Okay, let's get out of here. Now, where am I going? To... There. Next stop, the hangar cargo tram control. Welcome to the Ishimo tram system. Imagine if there's a guy in here who's just like, tickets please, tickets please. I'm like, have you been here the whole time? Do you know what's going on outside this tram man? Do you know what's going on? No, I'm just a ticket guy. I'm just a ticket guy. Store. Uh, what's this? It's, it's locked. I cannot go in there. I cannot. I cannot go in. Okay, those, they're all dead. Going up. There's an elevator guy here. <laughs> Just like presses the button for you. Going up, sir? Yes, going up. 
Why thank you, kind sir. Alright, here we go. Which way? Bathroom? What if I can go in here? The hell is that noise? Oof. Toilets. Nothing in here. Alright. I kind of just went in there and wasted my ammo. That sucked. Security reporting retrieved. What? Whoa! Okay, go to the hangar bay. Is there anything I can get in here? Let's have a look. Anything? All secure. Just bodies from last time. Alright. Okay, let's go. What can we save? Let's save. Safe, 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 safe. Better save her than sorry. Except. Okay, let's go. To the hangar bay. Please collect belongings before we go. That's locked. I cannot go in there. Immigration. I gotta go this way. It's a long way to go, man. Isaac, this damage report says there's a broken cargo lift just beyond the hangar doors. I'll open them now. Entering zero gravity. You'll need your thrusters to reach it, but that lift shaft should take you straight down to engineering. Okay. Intensive care complete. Chapter 3, course correction. Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. I'll see you in the next one. Don't forget to like and subscribe. To continue watching each episode. And, uh, bye for now.